Oh no, wait, so it is. No, 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 please come now, never mind. No, uh, maybe it's this treasure. Maybe it's this cave and the submerged castle that doesn't have a lot of valuable treasure. I can't remember. Man, that was a, a baby of a challenge. Man, that brother, that was harsh. Gosh, I'm not very sisterly, am I? Bro, you are right? Oh, don't be so young about it. Stop crying. Hey, don't tell mom. Uh, gosh, there's so many of you. I don't think I could babysit everybody. Gosh, you two come as a pair. You must be twins. Oh, that was too difficult. You're in trouble, buddy. That's why they put you in a box. Right? That's such a great joke. Now, actually, I should probably collect the enemies as well. It's not a lot, but it might help with the, uh, the debt collection anyway. Because afterwards we'll have to, like... Because I don't think there's much else in, uh... In the perplexing pool. So, well, I don't know. We're right on the cusp of it anyway, actually. Maybe we don't need that. Uh, you are the crayon, the stick, the joy, the colourful jar art. Art of joy. You having a lunch break, penguin dude? Alright, see you later. Probably be playing a new game by then. Master's Instrument! I knew that, too! But I thought that was the one that spawned right by, uh... Right by the blues. I was wrong. Alright, hey. Shall we sacrifice the blue? Since I need to sacrifice a Pikmin. And we do have a random blue. Maybe next floor. Kill the blue! We'll see. What if I say no? We're gonna sacrifice a yellow this time. Blue survives for now. But how long shall he survive? We shall see. We shall see. But remember, Blue, that could be you next time. Even, what is, uh, I, don't, I don't know this one. This is a canister. This is a, uh, I don't know what it is. It's a tin can, it's a container of, I keep saying container, we've already had containers. Also, we don't have the purples to attack the bread bugs, so I better be careful. Kill Barry! Oh, oh, this blue is, is Bartholomew, is he? The survival container! Oh wow, it's another container. All right, no more sacrifices. Blue lives another day as well. Another, another day. All right, bread bugs, what are you after? I need some of your jewels. You know one of you wants it. Come on. No? Not you? Come on. Do we not have anything worth carrying? There's definitely other treasure here. I guess I'll just have to use the baronet to get everything else I want. Yeah, they're coming for him anyway. <laughs> so how do breadbugs know not to attack a guy or like carry a guy that's sleeping? Just innate ability? They can tell? I guess you can tell when something's sleeping usually. Maybe that's it. What do I know? I'm afraid AI, you're going to need to be a little better than that. Also, we can just get purples. Alright. Well, maybe we should blow Barry in there. Nah. Barry's gonna live another day. But will he reach the end of the cave? We'll have to see. Oh shoot, it's going the wrong way, I just realized. Get out of here, please. Actually, a normal Pikmin can do this, right? Yeah, alright. It's only the giant bread bug that the purple Pikmin are required for. Excuse my stupidity. We'll be here in just a moment. Just a brief, a brief... A uh, break in our intelligence. Do do not mind me. Even if I can say my words right. This would be great. Oh, 
come on, there you go. You can't evade us that long. Now, what do you have? What's your treasure? Oh, it's the sweet cookie. It's the sweet roll. The roll of sugar. The swirly goodness. It's the bread of life. The swirly lurly. It's the glorified sugar diabetes. The sweet death. This is sweet death. Speaking of, I, I still have chocolate log in the fridge to eat. I should get around to that. I'm hungry. Dad, did you forget about your rule? No, I didn't. We're still doing it. Kind of. Um, whenever we get an enemy or... So it's going in with 50 Pikmin. We doubled it to be 20 of each, but we don't have 20 of most of the Pikmin, so we've only got 67 at the moment. Um, and then it's... We can't gain a Pikmin because we're in a cave, but imperative cookie. I don't even call it a cookie because it's not a cookie. It's a... I swear it's like a chopped up chocolate yog. Oh, well. Yog? Log. Um... But yeah, we've got it so that when we say an enemy name wrong or a treasure name wrong, we're doing sacrifices. Not able to gain Pikmin because we're in caves, unfortunately. But there you go, that's a little wrap-up. We are doing that. Currently the only rule in place? No? No, that's another rule. It was to make a pun every time we kill an enemy. I forgot about that. <laughs> I'll get back up on it. Your rule has killed 15 Pikmin. I hope you're, hope you're glad. All right, time for the big bad one. I know what's here. No, no I don't because I'm in the wrong place. All right, excuse me. Ah. Controller, please. Very relieving to know that one of these cannot kill you when they're alone. Even when they do the little sparky thing, it's just a preparation for the attack. So that's nice. It's relieving to know that they're not doomed the moment they flip back up again. Still pretty scary though, to go in this without just all yellows, like I usually do. Alright, Breadbug, you know what you're here for. Although actually you don't... We, no, we'll bother with you a little bit. Come on. And done. Thank you. Nah, survive it, survive it, white, survive it, yes! Look at that pro skill, beautiful. Purples, yes! Living on the edge a little bit, but it's fine. Go. Okay, he's over there. I was like, where did the, the blowhog go for a moment? But no, he's just up there. Come on. You're better than this. There you go. Look how quickly you died. Come on, dude. Just die for us. You don't need to make such a big huff out of it. Man. This guy seems, uh, well, the guy's blowing a lot of air and getting co covered by the color yellow. He must be quite the Hufflepuff, huh? No, no, none of these jokes hitting. Am I a failed comedian? Yeah? I see. Damn. Right, am I supposed to be sacrificing anything yet? Have I forgotten a sacrifice? I don't think so, no. Everyone's waiting for that 50th sacrifice. Maybe the 50th sacrifice should be. Uh, Bartholomew over here, but what do I know? We'll see who ends up in my hands. How's that sound? Alright, let's decide our, our sacrifice now. This is a gear. This is a 
guide. It's a gauge. It's the love gauge, the hate gauge, the revenge gauge, the, the, the head turner, the time turner, the hand turner, the ta the teller. It's a teller, a graph, a quadrant, a ball. It's a, it's a treasure I don't know the name of. I've always wanted to play the game fully like this, but never found the controls that actually let me to. Let me. And yet, it's doing it nicely now. I was pretty sure my playthrough, my playthrough, why do I keep doing that? My last playthrough of the game, I played like one of these whole, I think it might be even this floor, I just played it all like that. That was fun. I think I fast forwarded it. Right. Director of Destiny. I did not have that one in my mind. So here we go. Louis. I'm not looking. In fact, let me just press B a random number of times. Because possibly it could land on blue. Now just find some electrical current for us. And let go. In fact, their sacrifice will not be entirely in vain. Because we'll get an egg out of it. Oh, no! Not a beautiful white. And yet, there it goes. Ah, oh, cruel. I was like, dropping one? That's fine. Dropping two? That's suddenly not fun. Man, this stream really is just chilled out, isn't it? I guess it's because I'm not doing the submerged castle. I think that's entirely what that was. This 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 series basically came in and it was like, we're, we're looking forward to the submerged castle. This whole game is just the submerged castle. Can I actually... Oh. Didn't know that. If this was Pikmin 3, they'd be making sound effects on each of these. Where's our treasure then? Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. We do actually have to destroy a bread bug for this, huh? Come along now. We'll stay here. Louie will go and watch, though. If that's okay. Come on. You can do it. Lovely. Just take a nice little turn to the left here. Come on. Come on. There you go. I sneeze. <laughs> Damn it. You know, this whole place is just a metaphor for a toaster. I'm telling you now. He got toasted. Boom! Jesus, alright. The bell. It's like a dumbbell, it calls it or something. Not a dumbbell, but like a... A, a bangy bell. A colour bell. A bell of clarity. Of clappity. A clappity bell. I'm gonna call them clappity bells. But I'd, otherwise, I'm still lost. But yes, we're at 60. We're, we are at sacrifice 50 now. Congrats. We, we made it. You killed all these Pikmin. No, 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 no. That was a nice uh, harmonica. No, it's the other one, the French one. Never mind. <gasps> I said harmonica. Wasn't in the context of guessing the name, but I'm gonna take it. Bartholomew lives another day. Haha. -ha. Oh, we're at 10k! I didn't notice. Nice. The debt is done. Dumb Bell, more like dumb Daz. What do you mean? I didn't do anything dumb. All I know is that we're about to die. I remember this layout. I remember what's here. There he is. No, no, there he is. You know what? I'm gonna make this easier myself. Because I can. Never used it anyway. Oh, dude, it went right through him and into the babies. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, we're down. We got our debt. We don't need to worry about anything else. Although, if my controller could function, that would be quite nice. Uh, I have a question. 
The drone supplies, I didn't get that. We'll be doing a sacrifice in a moment. Its health bar isn't going to appear down there, is it? Oh, I should have whistled them, you know. Well, there goes the sacrifice. It was a four-person sacrifice for that, for that, for those uh, supplies. But then if I kill this bread bug now, does it come back and then have all its health regenerating back? Alright, my, my B button almost didn't work then. That was also another stress for me. No, you can get off it so the other guy can get on it. There you go. See, that's what I want to see. Damn it, no. That's not what I want to see. Purples, get on there. Beautiful. Controller. Function. Cool. So now, here's our question. What does the bull bear do? What does the bull bear do? Oh, the bull bear doesn't come back. Oof. They digested it full on. Alright. Now this is a sweet. Succulent sweet. Devastating sweet. Diet Doomer. Is that the Diet Doomba? Doomba. Doomer. I don't know. Will my controller ever function? I really don't know. Will this take any more Pikmin? Gosh, you can see my controller just swaying. It's entirely my setup and not the Wii. Or the Wii U. There we go, finally. Succulent sweet. Diet Duma. Looks more like a Diet Duma. No, it's white goodness. Damn it. You're a mug. You are a coffee. Uh, like a morning waker or something? You're like a... A day starter. I remember you're... I'm gonna get this anyway, but like you're... You're a... You're, a, you're like a... Morning coffee. You are a, a morning breaker. Invigorator. Yeah. So I kind of got it. I knew its reference. Only one sacrifice to the gods. Will it be Bartholomew? We'll find out next time. You don't think it comes back? Yeah, there you go. Sorry. Reading back up on things. Sure, Dad. Yeah, yeah. Let me have this, alright? Let me have it. I deserve some things in life. Alright? You know, if only this guy looked to the right, he'd be fine. Just turn a little bit to the right. He might have had a better life, but I guess, uh... I guess he was left and loaded. Locked and loaded? <laughs> Damn it, I wasn't even listening. Whoa, gonna make it a pun at the start, but thank you for subscribing, Sealander89. You can throw in a uh, rule, although we're right near the end, so there's not... Well, you can give me a, you can give me a rule for the giant bread bug, I guess, because I only wanted to get to the debt, but thanks for subscribing. You are our second ever subscriber. We only have one. We're quite a small channel, so thanks for doing that. I super greatly appreciate it. With the with the uh, the Twitch Prime. Can you can you come over this way, please? All right, those guys are done. Dungeon rings. No, nope, they're gonna be our, our our bait. They are our perfect bait. Oh damn it! How are they still not dead? Both sides. These yellows are clearly not superior warriors and soldiers of war. I wish there was the attention to detail that you could call on an enemy and it would like activate them. You know? That would be really cool. I'd like to see that in Pikmin 4. As much as that would be very horrifying. Because you could just go into a swarm and just be like and the whole thing just lights up. That would be cool. Or like an enemy where you're in a lot of darkness, but you can only see the eyes. Alrighty. That could be kind of cool. And you kind of have that with the uh, the Foss Bat that's in Pikmin 3, but I, I want more of that. I don't know. I don't know what I want. 
Pikmin has become very arcadey, which is a shame. Because I wanted more... Maybe not rpg -y, but open-worldly. You know? Oh, well. Right. You are a didgeridoo, a digi, a container, a pot, uh, a fun pack. Pot of gold, a diamond duo. Entertainer man, you are an antenna. Louis looks a little lost. I was going to say this isn't enough, but the purples will carry it enough. Yeah, I, d I don't know. You are the uh, antenna antenna. Interceptor receptionist. You are a digi. I keep thinking digi. Something or other. You could whistle to make light flowers bloom. Did Could you? I didn't actually know that. Oh, I, w I want more interactivity in the whistle. But yeah, like Breath of the Wild, I was like, oh, maybe. Like the idea of not having to go to s different areas. I don't know. I don't know what I want. I think I'd like like it where every odd Pikmin game, like 1 and 3 and 5, were the archaic Pikmin 1 style. And then 2, 4 and 6, I don't mean there to be 6 games, but you know what I mean, the, the even numbers to be explorative. Magic stage? No. Okay, i got to remember, the flip stuff is always a stage. It was the same with the makeup being a mirror stage. But no, um... I don't know, like I like how, ex like Pikmin 2 is still my personal favourite Pikmin game. Even though Pikmin 3 is objectively better, just because it's so... It's slower paced in that it's not about a rush to get everything done, it's about the adventure itself, you know? It's not about the end goal, it's about the adventure, and I like the exploration, I like the enemies and the... Antenna! Hey, I got that right. Alright, that's one sacrifice to whoever it is. Have we got any electricity around here, or is it just gonna be waiting next time? Are we needing two sacrifices now? I think we need two sacrifices. Yes, we do. Okay. Two sacrifices next floor. I think next floor is the last floor. Actually, I think there might be seven in this guy place. But no, I don't know. I want another explorative Pikmin. I don't mind there being another archaic one. Or arcade one, I guess I should be saying. Not archaic. But I prefer Pikmin when it's explorative. So I would prefer a Pikmin 4 that takes its time and shows me everything. It expands the game, you know? Because also Pikmin 3 was a bit of an amputation in that they brought new enemies and then just removed all the old ones. And it's like, alright, great, but there's not a lot of new enemies. We need see three sacrifices. Okay. Pikmin can be both arcadey and explorey. True! Pikmin 2 is both. I guess you're right. Well, it's less arcadey because of the time taken away. That's what I imagine by arcadey. Like, challenge mode is the arcade mode. That's what I... I don't know. Alright, so three sacrifices it is. Three must be thrown into here. But it can't be a yellow for obvious reasons. So let's let's up the stick. Where's Bartholomew? He's gone! I didn't even notice. Bartholomew never actually made it by natural causes. I was hoping he'd get all this way, but he he fell before we saw it. Was he crushed? He was probably crushed. Was he eaten? Maybe he was eaten. This is a sad day for all. But even worse... We need three sacrifices. Am I gonna look? I'll try not to. I don't want to be reminded. Hopefully they survive. We'll never know. There they are. They're trying. There they go. Alright. No sight either. We didn't need it. Oh, okay, cool. We have got something that we can actually carry as well. Alright, there go all our whites as well. Beautiful. What a way to end this series.
what you think Pikmin 3 is miss missing is more lore? Yeah, it kind of didn't do anything, did it? It just, it was just like a, I don't know. It was more a game than it was an experience, if you know what I mean. It Well, actually, I don't know about that. It felt like there was a lot of story going on, but it felt, I don't know. I don't know what I think. It felt a lot more, as weird as it sounds, it felt awfully linear. I guess it was the beginning, like, where you were trying to reunite with all the captains. It felt like, you must go here, then you must do this. This is your next goal, this is your next goal, this is your next goal. Whereas, like, in these, in Pikmin 1 and 2, it was a matter of, like, alright, you have the ability to go to these places, or to get these things. Go get them. Any order you want, you know, however you want to. It's, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I think entirely. Is the is the end goal? Is the end point here? Pigment three, I enjoyed. Just felt it was it, it it was missing something. I preferred Pikmin two over Pikmin three, even if it was a superior game. This is the donut of something. Yeah, I missed the ham as well. There's gonna be a lot of deaths. Uh, sweet dreamer, yeah. Did I say sweet? I don't even think I said sweet. Alright. No, I'll keep that. I think I said sweet. I've been saying sweet this whole time, so I knew something was a sweet. Uh, but I didn't get the hand, so let's get another sacrifice. Do we have anything? Do we have any whites? Great. White it is. I want one purple to survive this series, if it can. Well, oh, yeah. Never mind. That was a sacrificable white. Thank you. We would like some egg. We're a fried bassin, a UFO, spaceship, spacecraft. White, how have you not died yet? Is there only one of you? No, there is two. These guys just aren't very good at connecting. Alright, white survives. Oh, I thought I got it. some sort of extinction then. It was the right timing. That was weird. Yeah, the story was very... Narrow. Hideous Victual. I didn't know that one either. We have one white and one purple left. Oh no, I think we've got a white over there. And of course now they connect. Alright, we need one of you to die. So we need the white to die first, please. So then we can get the giant bread bug on it. And then we can get on with our day. Cool. I hope we've got a white in our pack. I've always lost all our whites. I don't see another another purple flower. Good lord. And I couldn't sacrifice a yellow if I wanted to over here. This is a sad existence. We started with no purples. And, and, and well, no, we started with seven purple. Seven purples and two whites, I think we had? No. Seven whites and two purples. Spent most of the stream with zero purples. And now we've made zero whites, and one purple remains. Bartholomew was lost. Bolt was lost. Terry. Barry. This was quite the adventure. Many sacrifices were had. It was a sad time for all. And yes, we do want this guy dead. With the last ounce of assets in this room, we can only just take down the giant red bug. If he notices the dead body. <coughs> you can kill a yellow if you let the bread bug drive it into the mist. This is a good point. Cool. I think we might actually be able to get all of our Pikmin out in one go at the end of this. Like, we'll go back to the onions and be like, we have less than 100 in total. Then again, we did do a lot of harvesting, so what do I know? There he goes. With the erasing eraser. The, uh, rubber. Rubber shoe. Rubber glove. Electrolux. Electrolux electrolyte. One of those words. With your Mario pencil, your Mario paint, your Mario eraser, and your Mario crayon. Does the purple survive? No. I did not think dream material. And I'm afraid 
There are no sacrifices to be had for a yellow here. We could have sacrificed it to a, a giant bread bug, but nothing else is left to kill them. Now that the bread bug is gone too. It has to be this way. High value Pikmin. We sacrificed a lot last stream and none remain by the end of this one. Thirty-six deaths, oof. <laughs> Time for an ending cutscene! Ha ha! Their, their profiles are going underneath the earth a little bit. Oh, they're coming out of the edges, actually. Okay, that's normal. Never mind. I think. Do we have to go through this whole credits? I mean, I guess we can. It is going to be the end of this series for now. So yes, I only want to get to the uh, end of this debt because I felt it was a kind of a good place to end off without going. Because I don't know. I would like to finish this game 100% eventually. But I don't think right now. I imagine we'll come back to this series in a few months' time. Uh, next time I'm feeling like doing Super Chat. It'll be a fun time. It's been nice. I've really enjoyed finding a new like way to play the game again Because like I've played the game a lot to the point where it's like I it, I feel more like a robot playing the game Than playing the game if that makes sense because it's like now I go here I press this I do this and I do this like a almost like a speed runner except you know I don't do it fast. I just do it. It's very Robotic so to have the extra challenges has been a nice little experience that I wanted to take on um we have lost a lot of Pikmin. We've lost Louis as well. I see people pressing F to pay respects. Oh. How many did we lose the end? Over 300. And then we had 50 sacrifices today, I think. So, uh, 350? We'll find out in a moment. We got an extra 36 deaths. Well, they weren't all sacrifices, actually. But we lost a lot of lives on this adventure. I thank you for joining me. And we don't worry. If you're watching this live, we're doing another stream straight after this. We're moving into another Let's Play that I want to do. Because I just had an itching feeling to do it for the longest time and I need to need to scratch that itch. Don't worry. And I'll explain more details after the credits because for the people that are watching on YouTube in bite-sized versions, probably don't want to hear it right now. Although, if you are watching live, you would like to, and you don't know already, I do upload all of these. Uh, we've got, we'll have the VODs available on Twitch if you want to watch the full live stream. But that's only for the first two weeks that this comes out. Otherwise, I have bite-sized versions on my YouTube channels. Uh, Daz Let's Plays, if you want to go see that. Anyway, what do we have? 12 days, 387 Pikmin lost. 206 to battle, 19 to fire, 16 to water. Those are all sacrifices, I think. 74 to electricity. Ouch. 9 to poison, 555 born. Uh, no round numbers for the colors, are there? Nope, they're all slightly off. 
Eight hours. Ooh! Notification! Sea Lander, thanks for also following us. So when we come back, we'll be playing as the president in the Wistful Wilds with however many Pikmin are left. Get to start playing those real hard caves. Segmented Crawbster. I'm actually going to hop in for a little bit to check one last little thing. But that'll be a thing we'll do at one point. Right, let me check some damages, and then we'll be done. Or we'll have a tutorial, or whatever this is supposed to be. Story? I don't know. You've arrived, Hogtate Freight, like me. Ask that. Could Louie? You must. I could only see half the screen, so uh, I wasn't going from the beginning of the line. Do excuse me. Yep. No red or, or not reds, no whites or purples alive. Ouch. We have 231 Pikmin. Is that 100 of each color? Nope. Not even close. Well, actually, it's basically a th 33 for each one, basically. That's actually an oddly perfect number. Look at that. Oh, that's not the right number. Crazy. We have basically a perfect third. This is all the yellows, but and I can't aim on them. Come on, there we go. But yeah, this is how we're going to be starting next time we come back to this. I don't want to be swarming. Come on. Above this yield shine. We can do it. Yield sign. I'm not even pressing down. Dudes, come on. Controller. Just let me look at the things. There we go. So next time we come back here, we'll have a hundred of all these colors. We'll have the present and we'll take on this for a while. It may be a few months, but that'll be then. And this is now. So uh, I thank you all for watching, whether you're watching live or in a bite-sized episode months and months later. But for now, my name's been Daz. You didn't really care and Louie is never going to look at the camera. I'll see you in a bit.